Hello and welcome. In today's training session, we're going to cover the Keystone EasyVet integration. Let's start with an overview. The EasyVet Keystone integration allows you to make a diagnostic request in EasyVet. That request will flow to the Keystone schedule and then the patient information will populate automatically onto your modality work list. Modalities include x-ray, ultrasound, CT, MRI, fluoroscopy, etc. After acquiring your images and ending the study, imaging data will flow back to the Keystone Viewing Suite, where it will also be made available to flow into the EasyVet Diagnostic Results section. Let's get started. Log into your EasyVet account and go to the green clinical tab. Now we can search for our patient. I'll be using Cookie as our test case. Once we're in Cookie's file, we can go to the Diagnostic and Treatments tab. Below, you'll see the diagnostic request. Click on the green plus icon to pull up the diagnostic request. This is where you can select your desired modality and type of imaging. In this case, let's assume the veterinarian has requested four view radiographs. Start by selecting the supplier dropdown and type in AST or Asteris. You'll see each modality has its own code. Since we're requesting x-rays, I'll be selecting DR for digital radiography. Now you can choose the type of imaging. Each clinic may vary depending on how the diagnostic codes were set up. In this case, I'll select four view radiographs. Now that the supplier and the requested diagnostic are entered, we can select add to send the request. Quick reminder, this will also trigger a billing code for the four view radiographs. You can see below the request is scheduled and available on the modality. Now that the request has been sent, you'll want to go to the X-ray acquisition computer, select and query the work list. The patient name will populate and you'll be able to create a study for your four view X-rays. Require your X-rays, end the study and images will flow into Keystone for viewing. At the same time, EasyVet will pull the images from Keystone and put them in the Diagnostic Results section as thumbnails, as you can see here. Keystone can easily be launched directly from the EasyVet Diagnostic Results section by clicking the Asteris icon. Now you can view your images with all of the available tools and features. Be sure to log in if you'd like to save any annotations or send emails. If you'd like to send the images with the referral letter, you can easily do that in the summary section of EasyVet. Simply include the diagnostic results section to your report. Once you generate the report for email, an imaging online viewable external link will be provided. The recipient of the report will be able to click on the link and immediately pull up the radiographs on the Keystone Omni viewing suite. Now let's cover how to handle emergency imaging. In a situation where the animal needs emergent imaging, go ahead and enter basic patient information at the modality and collect your images. Images will be made immediately available to the Keystone Viewing Suite. Once the emergency has been triaged and taken care of, you can go back to EasyVet and enter in the diagnostic request for the imaging that you did during the emergency. Go ahead and select your supplier and add the diagnostics that you did. Click Add. Now that you have the diagnostic request, you'll want to make a copy of the unique lab reference ID. I am highlighting the ID and pressing Control C to copy it. Now we can go to the EasyVet dashboard and select Work List. Under Unallocated Results, we'll find the images that were taken during the emergency. Double click on the images, go to the Request tab, and paste your unique lab reference ID. I'll be using Control V to paste. Now click Update, and the images will be pulled directly into the patient file. 
Well, that's going to conclude our training session on the EasyVet Keystone integration. Stay tuned for more videos. Thanks again for watching.